Police want you to be on alert. They say a home repair scam bilked a 91-year-old woman out of thousands of dollars in Nash County. A half dozen people are now under arrest. But as CBS North Carolina's Steve Sprazier reports, police say it's a growing problem. The victim says it all began with repairs that were supposed to be made to this and other vents beneath her home by suspect Jim Bullock. She says, and then it just kept getting bigger and bigger with more and more people becoming involved. In all, seven people were arrested and charged with exploiting a disabled or elderly person's trust. Deputies say the victim lost $13,000. Investigators say the suspects claimed to be doing plumbing work under this house, work that was never performed. We actually had a, um, a Nash County uh, inspector go out there and do, do a courtesy inspection of the house, and uh, his findings were they want not, the work that was supposed to be done done, and they were just getting checks all along for about a two-month period. These arrest warrants for suspect Travis Tyndall, obtained by CBS North Carolina from April to June, show the victim gave him checks worth hundreds of dollars at a time for work the warrants say was never performed. Advocates for the elderly say it's a growing problem. My seniors here at our center have been personally targeted for various scams and schemes, um, ranging from telemarketing schemes to computer or people just showing up at their house wanting to do home and the victim in this case told us she didn't want to speak on camera about the situation, but did tell me she wished she'd been smarter about dealing with those who offered to do the repairs. Other seniors in town say there's no shame in asking for help. We're all seniors, and you could get taken by anybody, but if you're that age and you're having to take, take care of your own business, you need somebody to help you. Get some advice. Yes, get some advice. The victim told me she was able to stop payment on three of the checks, but a lot of that money is still still missing and she's hoping to get it back when all the cases finally make their way through the court system. In Nash County, I'm Steve Sprazier, CBS, North Carolina. And police say if you're looking for contractors for home repairs, be sure to ask for a license for plumbers and electricians and check with the Better Business Bureau. They also suggest you ask for references.